Hey, end time saints, targeted angels. Father keeps showing me these visions of Pegasus. We're getting our Pegasus. But uh, this is at least my seventh or eighth time to make this video. So I'm going to try to just stick to uh, the word of knowledge is what I call it that Father gave me this, this morning. And I will try to come back on later today if everything works on the computer. And uh, Father allows me to come back on and share with y'all. Uh, my dreams have been being messed with because my sleep has been being messed with. So Father will come through in other ways, like signs or words of knowledge, which is what he did this morning. But I normally do not get this long of a word of knowledge where he tells me specifically to get my notebook out. He wants to speak something to me and have me write it down. And he will have me write it down because I'm old school, but also because uh, my phone was just stolen again. A whole nother story. Uh, I believe that I'm not... I was not supposed to make it out of what just happened to me. And the Buford T. Disjustices were part of it. They're Satan's henchmen. And uh, ultimately, it's Satan, okay, that's working through these people that are coming against us. And that's what Father shared in this word of knowledge today. So there's lots of construction and noise harassment going on. So I'm at the farthest away I can get from the door, so it's still loud. So just bear with me, y'all. Hopefully y'all can hear this. I'm having to yell, actually. Okay, that and Satan does not want this out. So when you hear the slamming doors and the horn honking and the drilling and the sanding and all that, that's actually the serpent working through these people that bow down to the beast. So this was given this morning on 10 24 The first part I'm not going to read because I believe it was just for me. Father even started it with daughter, okay? So it's only about a paragraph, but it's something that I feel is just for me. And maybe that's why Father allowed, you know, the videos to be hacked into and not go up. And so now on this, like, I think this is literally my seventh attempt to make this, he shared with me, don't put that first part in there. So I'm going to start with the part where he says, tell my elect. Okay, so that's you. If you are a persecuted, targeted individual, your father's elect. The most high God is my father. Let me clarify that. Tell my elect not much longer. Stay outside longer. Grounding is good, but they are spraying poison on the grass. Pray over the grass before sitting down or putting bare feet in it. Pray. Above all else, keep your vibration high. You become weaker and can have your emotions controlled by the snake when you remain angry or sad or in fear. You retain the high frequency I put in all my elect when you are praising, laughing, and being kind, no matter what they are doing. They can only affect and thus infect you when you dwell on the harassment. This is ultimately Satan who is manipulating those coming against you. Remember, they are lost souls. Look at them as Jesus did in pity or with pity those that are human which are only about one third of the population now so he's saying to have pity on those which are human not the rest they're demonic okay reptoids sleep stack if you will he didn't say that part <laughs> those that are human which are only about one third of the population now the rest are not and were never mind Spend your time seeking me, and I will guide you. Detoxify your temple. No meat for now. Fish. Not only consume it, but be my fisher of men. Raphael is on the way, 
and will bring a great breakthrough for my persecuted angels. He will wash away the rest who are not whom they profess. Fire, water, boulders, bridges, decks, ditches, rooftops, cities underwater while set ablaze. I trained you and the rest of the elect for this very time. Full armor always. Be thankful for this mission. Do not doubt my voice. I am sending Michael to the remnant and will give all those who are battle-weary comfort. Time is at hand. Love your Father who art in heaven. 